within me. Creating me a clean heart, oh my Lord. I'd renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from your presence, my Lord. Take not your holy spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of your salvation. And renew my right spirit within me. Cast me not away from your presence, O oh Lord. Take not your holy spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of your salvation and renew our right spirit. Today, we read from the Gospel of St. Matthew, chapter 25, verses 31 to 46. Matthew, chapter 25, verses 31 to 46. I will not take the entire script, I will only share those verses that have stood out for me. Jesus said to his disciples, when the Son of Man comes in his glory, all the nations will be assembled before him. He will place the sheep on his right and the goats on his left. Then the king will say to those on his right, come, you who are blessed, by my Father. Inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. For I was hungry and you gave me food. Amen, I say to you, whatever you did for one of these least brothers of mine, you did for me. Then he will say to those on his left, Depart from me, you are cast into the eternal fire, prepared for the devil and his angels. For I was hungry, and you gave me no food. Amen. I say to you, what you did not do for one of these least ones, you did not do for me. And this will go off to eternal punishment, but the righteous to eternal life. From this word today, I still ponder on a question. If Jesus were to come back today, on which of the sides would I be? Dear friend, I would like you to ask yourself that same question on which side of Jesus would you be would you be on his left or on his right the answer lies deep in our hearts but like the word of the Lord is telling us today that whatsoever we do for the least ones we do it for Jesus. We do it for God. And in this season of Lent, I invite you, dear friends, dear brother, dear sister, that you be a better person, 
I should be a better person as well. In the little few things that I can do, in the little good deeds that I can do, I should be able to do. If there is anyone close by that is in need, could you please offer a hand to those people? My prayer today is that, dear Jesus, teach me to be a better friend. Teach me to be a better sibling to my siblings and to you. Teach me to be a, ch a better child to my parents. Teach me to be a better person everywhere I go, that I may see your face and that I may see you in everyone that I meet. Give me a heart of charity. Give me a heart of selflessness. Give me a heart that is as generous as you are so that I can be able to share the little that I have with those that I meet. Thank you, Jesus. Cast me not away from your presence, O Lord. Take not your Holy Spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of your salvation and renew your eyes within me oh renew the right spirit within me in Jesus' name we pray amen